Hi, this is a demonstration of Android based antenna positioning system project. So here we demonstrate uh, how we can manually position antennas using uh, an Android device. So in sensitive applications like radars and other, uh, you know, large scale uh, antennas, uh, which are used to uh, detect uh, long range signals need to be position positioned in real time as per the satellites or transmitters to capture signals more accurately. So for this uh, purpose, we here propose a system that allows the user to manipulate the antenna position as per commands provided by the user through his Android device. So for this purpose, as you can see here, we are using an A0 fan family microcontroller. The microcontroller is interfaced to an LCD display to display the status of the antenna, the current position as well as where it is moving. And also we here have a step promoter which is used to demonstrate as the antenna motor and is used to position the, position the antenna. And this is a Bluetooth receiver modem here. This is used to receive Bluetooth commands sent by the user through his Android device. And the entire system is powered by a 12 volt transformer. So now let's see how the system works. So the system has been turned on now. So here it's uh, giving us the instructions that for direction it uh, needs uh, two signals either A or C that is anti-clockwise or clockwise and for the speed it needs low high or medium which is uh, demonstrated by L, H and M alphabets. Similarly, the direction is to be uh, fed as A or C that is anti-clockwise or clockwise. And now let's talk about the antenna position. So since uh, every uh, step is of a particular uh, angle, so for this purpose, we will be manipulating the angle of the motor or the uh, antenna using steps. So we would be providing the number of steps and based on that uh, uh, we would be uh, manipulating the position. So suppose 180 degree angle uh, is to be uh, you know achieved. The motor has to be turned in 180 degree angle but since each step is of uh, 7.5 degrees so we would be providing the number of steps. So approximately for uh, actually accurately for achieving 180 degree rotation we would need uh, 24 steps so we have to provide that uh, number of steps through the android device so for 90 degree for example we would be requiring 12 steps so we would be providing 12 so let's see a small demonstration of the system let's uh, use our android device here So the device is now connected. So first let's see a 90 degree angle here. So to achieve 90 degree, we must first uh, provide 12 steps. So let's enter 0, 1, 2. After that, we need to provide the direction that is anti-clockwise or clockwise. So let's first check the anti-clockwise direction. Let's uh, type capital A. And now the speed, so at what speed should the system, the motor move the antenna in that uh, required direction. So let's uh, set uh, fast here that is high H, capital H. And now let's supply this command and let's see how the antenna turns. So as you can see, it uh, made a 90 degree turn at a high speed. So now let's check uh, one more. Let's uh, do a 180 degree turn now. For that we will be supplying uh, the number 024 because we will be needing 24 steps to achieve that angle. And now let's check the clockwise direction. That is C, capital C. And after that the speed. Now let's uh, do this at uh, low speed that is capital L 
now let, let's apply the command and see how it turns so now you can see that it is turning at a so, slow speed and now it will uh, achieve that uh, 180 degree rotation in some time and then it will stop So as you can see here, the, by the commands provided by the user, based on those commands, our uh, system uh, you know, manipulates the angle and moves the motor to achieve that particular angle. So this is how user can easily position antennas, large antennas uh, to point in particular direction to uh, get the required signal accurately. So this is how the system works. Thank you.